Welcome to Sexual Health Sheffield Vasectomy Service. I'm one of the staff nurses and often provide vasectomy counselling for patients. In this short video, we'll be discussing everything you'll need to know if you're considering having a vasectomy. In preparation for the vasectomy procedure, we ask you to complete the following. Two days before the operation, please shave the sides and the base of the scrotum, including the hair around the base of the penis. Please make sure you avoid hair removal cream or wax as this could cause a reaction. Immediately before coming to the clinic, we advise having a shower or a bath as you won't be able to have one for 48 hours after the operation. Please eat a light meal two hours before coming to the clinic to avoid you becoming faint and please don't have any alcohol on the day of the operation. We ask you to bring along a tight pair of underpants to support the scrotum following the procedure and then let the clinician know if you develop any sensitivity to local anaesthetic or any other medication. You can expect to be in the clinic for one to two hours and we ask you to arrange transport home as you will be unable to drive and we do not recommend public transport. You will be sent some MRSA swabs in the post. It's really important that you complete these and drop them to your GP as soon as possible. If you don't do this, we will be unable to perform the operation. On the day of the operation, you will be greeted at reception by a member of staff who will take you to a private room to change into a hospital gown. Once you are changed, that member of staff will then escort you to the theatres where the operation will take place. The operation itself is done under a local anaesthetic and roughly takes between 20 to 30 minutes to complete. They will start by cleaning the scrotum with an antiseptic solution and then inject with a local anaesthetic. Once you are numb, they will locate both fast tubes and make a small incision. This will either be one incision or can sometimes be two incisions. Once they have made this incision, they will bring the vas tubes to the surface of the skin, but whilst this is being done, you may experience some discomfort. They will then cauterize and remove a segment of the vas tube and cauterize each end to prevent any bleeding. After this, you will then be taken to a separate room to recover and given something to eat or drink, and then once you feel able to, you will be able to go home roughly after 20 minutes. Following the operation, you will have no stitches or dressing, just the gauze that's kept in place by your underwear. In roughly one to two hours when the local anaesthetic wears off, you may start to experience some discomfort and we therefore advise taking paracetamol as and when you require. We advise to rest and support the scrotum well for 48 hours and to keep the area dry. After 48 hours, you can have a bath or a shower, but ensure you dry the area well and dab, don't rub, as this may take off the scab. Please take some time off work. We normally advise taking a week off work, but if you have a physically demanding or manual job, this may be longer. Please avoid exercise for two weeks and any contact sport for four weeks. And please ensure that if you're having any problem passing urine, you see your GP. You can have sex again as soon as it feels comfortable for you, but just ensure you have another contraception in place until you've been given the all clear. Due to the current COVID-19 restrictions, it's important that you strictly socially distance for 14 days before the operation. 72 hours before the procedure, you'll be given an appointment at the sexual health clinic to come and complete some COVID swabs. Once this is done, you must go home and strictly self-isolate until the day of your operation. If you develop any symptoms of COVID, please call and inform the clinic so that your operation may be rearranged. Please come on your own and wear a mask when you attend. The operations will be held at the Royal Hallamshire Hospital, B Road, Day Case, Door 6. If you require any further detail, please ask when you attend for the swabs.